Julie owns 350 shares of stock in one company. On Tuesday, the stock price dropped $13 per share. What was the total effect on Julie's portfolio? The total effect is equal to the gain or the total effect is equal to the gain or loss per share times the number of shares. And because the price dropped $13 per share and Julie has 350 shares, the total effect is equal to negative 13 times 350. The negative 13 indicates the drop of $13 per share. So again, the total effect is equal to negative 13 times 350. A negative times a positive is negative. So we know the product is negative, and now we need to determine what 13 times 350 is, or 350 times 13. Let's work this out below. We have 350 times 13. We first multiply by three. Three times zero is zero. Three times five is 15. Record the five, perform an exchange with the one. Three times three is nine, plus one is 10. And now we multiply by one, However, the one is in the tens place value, and therefore we place a zero in the ones place value before multiplying by the one. And now we multiply by one. One times zero is zero, one times five is five, and one times three is three. And now we add 350 times 13 is equal to 4,550, and therefore the total effect is negative 4,550. And the units here would be dollars, which indicates Julie has a loss of $4,550 from the drop of $13 per share since she owns 350 shares. I hope you found this helpful.